Hello, we are at Hetch Hetchy Reservoir in Yosemite National Park. This is our last day in Yosemite. We uh, actually catch this on the way out. It's the uh, road off to here is about one mile below the park entrance uh, on Highway 120. Uh, it's a beautiful reservoir. It's got a power plant, a dam and a power plant here, which John Muir fought <laughs> a lot uh, building it back when they uh, made it a hundred years ago, but uh, it's actually a beautiful place. Want to add? Well, we're walking around the reservoir a bit to a falls, which I don't know how to say. Wapama? Wapama? Wap Wapama? Well, whatever it is, <laughs> we're taking a walk to the falls and yes. enjoying the scenery. Yep. Actually, it's very, it's very reflective. Uh, you should see it from this side in my, I'm videoing, and now you're taking my picture. <laughs> go on top of rock facing down towards the dam. coming up to a place, a crossing of a waterfall that I don't quite know how to pronounce. It's way up there. Not much water in it right now. Tu Tuelala Falls or something like that. I think where we cross is around the corner here, but there doesn't seem to be a bridge. I can imagine that it would be uh, pretty darn tricky in a high water time. Yeah, just you gotta cross it right over the rock where it flows over the rock, so it's not much right now. But in high water time, in a high raid time like uh, in May or so, this would be possible. And here is Em standing right in the middle of it. is fun.
there's a warning sign. Cross at your own risk. So there's little splashes coming on the bridge here. Closing comments about this hike, uh, it's listed as moderate and it's not because it's so long or there's such an elevation gain, but it's pretty rocky in places. You'll need a good sense of balance and some good shoes. And depending on the time of the year, there can be some water crossings that are tricky and, and even uh, the trail itself flooded a bit. Uh, the bridge at high water season would be closed and so you wouldn't be able to get on it like we did. April is when we were here, that seemed to be pretty good. I think later in the summer, it's in the open a lot so uh, it would be pretty hot. But it is a highly re recommended hot hike. Uh, not too many people come out here, but uh, try it out, you'll, you'll really enjoy it. 